Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, on this blessed Sunday, day, let us give thanks for stuff and things. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What's up, tubers? Welcome back to the channel. Got another What's in the Box video for you. Today we're working with something uh, extremely different for me. Uh, it's an Aoshima 124th scale. <laughs> it's, it's a food truck. Uh, it's one of those little K trucks that's got food service. I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea what's inside of this thing, but uh, I'm pretty excited about it. It was on the uh, lower priced tier shelf at the hobby shop. And I don't know. We're going to open this thing up and see what all's in there. A oh, nice decal sheet. And take a look, see what the possibilities are. Come on, slice the box, not my finger. Don't do what I do, I'm an idiot. <laughs> so, let's flip it and check it. Wow, that's a huge decal sheet. Hey, golly gee whiz, beaver. <laughs> what, did I just date myself with that one or what? Uh, I mean, other than it, come on, get the rice paper off of there. Wow, really bright, colorful stuff. Uh, I don't know if I'm holding it upside down or not. No, yeah, that's right. Um, I mean, I don't want to be offensive or just, you know, distasteful. I don't speak that language, so I don't know what any of that stuff says. Um, it's a food service truck of sorts, but we'll see. Let's see what the kit has for uh, actual food items. Uh, looks like there might be something in there. I don't know. Ooh, it's a person? Neat. The typical uh, Yoshima drawings, instructions are pretty clear. Let's get right into the body. Uh, I can see one thing right away. I'm not, I mean, I'm not disappointed, but I was hoping that that was separate. But it wouldn't take much cut there and there maybe would that still be a part of it no uh, I don't know I was thinking about maybe making a little hot rod K truck but I mean I could still do that just make it a food truck I guess so that's just as cool uh, let's see the other body parts here actually let's look at the body it's got some nice details to it um, real crisp. Most of the Yoshima stuff that I worked with has been really nice. Really uh, good depth in the panel lines and good details on the, like all the, the hinges have nice proud bolts and handles and stuff. This is going to paint up the detail up nice. Um, <laughs> this is too funny. Uh, oh, well, there's a couple people. There's a, looks like, was that a, a, a chef and a sous chef? Wow. He does not look very happy. Uh, huh? Looks like a very angry. Oh, he doesn't look too happy either. <laughs> I don't know. I, I haven't painted too many figures. I mean, did the stig, but come on, how hard was that? Okay, let's uh, look at the. Looks like those are flags, you know, the advertisements. Another flag there, and you look like food serving items looks like uh, some sort of walk maybe looks like uh, some sort of walk 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 maybe and then see those are raised up and that one's recessed so you could probably paint all that different colors and I'll try to hold it still so you can see it does that help <laughs> uh I, I can't i don't know i can't understand what the stickers say Oh, well, that one's pretty easy. That one says, Hamburgueso uh, Caliente Pero. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, that's neat. Yeah, I don't know if I want to make a hot dog or a hamburger truck out of it. I don't know. More food service stuff. Looks like, uh, looks like that's got a little lid to it. vending machine, soda machine or something of some sort. More banners and side curtains. 
I mean, judging from what the box looks like, bing, bing, bong, bong, bong. It's pretty neat. It's got a, like a pagoda style little canopy. Kind of cool. Here, let me just put that on mute now. I thought I did before I started this. My apologies. How rude. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. <laughs> Again, it's a K truck, so. Uh, and if you don't know what that is, I'll put a put a video up uh, or a link or I don't know. There's you ever watch Mighty Car Mods? Those guys took one and hot rodded it. Two of them actually. <laughs> Those things are tiny. I don't, do I have any other tires nearby? Yeah, let's see. These are off the Datsun 240Z, which are already small tires. So, <laughs> and then some Steelies. Hey, well, we'll go on there with it while I'm on the sprue. <laughs> so there's four of those and oh, two sets of nibs. Got the Steelers, or I don't know, that might be a aluminum actually. <laughs> Who knows? A little bit of detail on the bottom side, not a whole lot. There's a whatever kind of engine these things have, a little small one, but there's a little bit. So pretty, pretty nominal on the on the bottom side details. Looks like it's the same with the steering and suspension and all that. Interior tub. Also, it's got a shifter and some mirrors. Steering wheel. What is that? I'm not sure what that is. And then your, your grill and your bumper. And then part of the interior of the cooking section. I guess those food service items will go on top of that. Oh, and then there's some other wheel options. Oh, that's cool. Neat. And then is that supposed to be an antenna? No. Yeah. It would be crazy to do this thing all mad Bozozuko style or something just wild. Oh, look, neat little, uh, more pagoda style lamps. Those are going to be pretty neat. I don't know. It would be pretty cool to just make a flatbed K truck. Or a mini pickup, and then I mean, that's just a square box. You could extend it and make a little single shack. I don't know. Windows, a whole bunch of them. And that's about it for the uh, Hiroshima. Uh, uh, <coughs> the the Goyo Dunya. I, don't, I have no idea what I'm even saying there. Yeah, thanks for watching. Happy Easter, happy holiday, whatever, if that means anything to you. It's Sunday, I'm on a slow afternoon. Or, no, it's Saturday right now. Whoa, magic of editing and video. This will be up on Sunday. Happy Easter, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.